very good afternoon my friends how are you hope you guys are doing very well and welcome on this new weekly market analysis video from extreme trader this is Salah speaking you have no idea how much I'm very happy and very proud of our results in the extreme trader premium signals group last week uh, we were able to finish every single day in a very good and decent profit maybe on Monday we closed with a break even or actually a small profit however nobody have lost money on that day hopefully then the rest of the week we ended it all in a great profit especially friday we closed friday with almost 145 pips of profit delivered to our members only in just one day i mean that is amazing that is what we are used to have every weekend and when we are showing the results of our forex signals we are used to see only green colors and very rare red or blank colors like that if you think i'm overreacting you can take a look at the messages we have received from the members they are really happy and very glad for the week this guy is saying happy weekend to you and to the team great first week and these are the results we had i think if i'm not mistaken this is from uh friday then this guy is saying 16 percent he growed his account 16 percent of gains in just one day that is outstanding amazing actually this guy here he's saying thank you to angela and he's just started off with the live account uh, very good signals today um i wanted to show you this guy here also he made 1217 dollars of profit in just one day that's amazing he just paid 50 dollars a month and then he got in one day only 1217 dollars of profit that's really that's amazing i'm i'm surprised i'm i'm shocked actually that's more than what i wanted and these are the results as well nice profits with the proper risk management trust the process it works so again it was really amazing week thank you angela indeed it was really uh, amazing job what you have done angela and i'm very proud of your work uh, i'm really happy because all the clients in the premium group are very glad and very happy look at that amazing guys the screen is only full of profits 536 dollars of profit have been made in one day outstanding thank you angela and thanks for the clients in the group however guys if you wish to join the winning team and if you wish to join extreme trader premium signals group please don't hesitate to contact angela you can find her contact details in the description below this video contact her today and hopefully we will see you there so let's start right now the weekly analysis and as usual we're going to start with the euro usd now from the first view at the euro usd you might say that we are right now on a resistance number two after having here a resistance number one and you might think the pair is now ranging on a resistance number two however that's from my point of view is not the case actually the, re the real resistance level is lying right here that is here the resistance level as we can see and that what happened here was a fake breakout and right here we can see the last attempt of the resistance then recently the euro usd has actually broken out from that resistance let's take a look here on the four hour chart and zoom in we can see very clear that this is a resistance level and the bullish momentum is quite strong the reason for that is that the US dollar is losing its strength and is getting now more weaker. Uh, in my opinion, the Euro dollar is going to continue the growth all the way until it hit this resistance level right here. Therefore, what we are going to do this week with the Euro USD is going to be the buy order. And we are just going to hopefully waiting for the pair. Let me just be accurate as much as possible. Like that. So we're just going to wait for the pair to finish the small pullback right here, hitting this previous support level, which was also a, a support right here and right here. Definitely that support level is going to be still respected and the pound, uh, sorry, and the euro USD uh, is going to continue the growth. And we can actually expect from the euro USD to fall a little bit more to hit this previous support level as it is actually the lowest level of this support level uh, level right here however i don't think this is gonna happen most likely the euro usd is gonna continue the rise right away 
but as I said, we can expect from it to fall for very few pips here just to hit this previous support level as we can see we're having right here a support number one so we can expect from the pair to create another support number two just to finally retest the broken resistance before continue the growth so in other words we can expect the pair to go against us for nearly 25 pips no more hopefully no more if it goes uh, uh, if you see any bearish breakout candle below this support level please close the trade with the loss and however if the prediction was correct we can look for almost 124 pips of profit so euro usd this week for the buy on the level 1.09631 and we can keep the trade running all the way until it hit this take profit level at the next resistance on 1.10873 so hopefully the prediction is oh i forgot to mention the take profit here and so hopefully this analysis is gonna be accurate and we will make some good profit out of this signal let's check next the pound usd now for the pound usd as we can see what happened here in the pound usd uh, we can see that there was a final reversal from that resistance level right here the pair has reversed after hitting this resistance however what's happening right here is retesting the broken resistance trend line as we can see like that uh, let me just draw it correctly just to be sure just somehow like that yes as we can see we are having here a resistance trend line number one number two number three then the pair after hitting this resistance after hitting this resistance level it now fall down and it's gonna continue falling only just for short term to just to retest the broken support trend line actually let me just correct it it's like that that's more accurate let me just fix it again i don't know it's happening like that so as you can see the pair is very close to actually retesting or finish the retesting of the broken resistance trend line and if we look if we look at the left actually we can see that we have here a strong resistance level which has been broken out like that i'm just aligning my resistance line to make it accurate as much as possible that is perfect now we can see that the pair is very close to hit this previous support level right here which was also a strong resistance and also is gonna complete the retest form for the resistance trend line that means the pound usd is gonna continue the rising but not for so long in my opinion let me just uh, zoom out more in my opinion the pound usd is gonna continue growing all the way oh shit until it hit this previous uh, support level right here after hitting that previous support level most likely the pair is gonna continue falling i don't think the pair is gonna continue the bullish momentum uh, the bullish momentum after that resistance therefore uh, we are going to send the signal actually it's gonna be a short term signal let me just be let me just correct it again just to be sure like that so we can start actually like that yes just to make sure everyone is gonna be safe so it's gonna be a short term signal as i said uh, we can start buying the pound usd from this point from this previous support level and keep the trade running until it finally hit this resistance because we need to see any price action if it's either indicating a reversal or a continuation and a break out from the resistance however we just want to secure the profits that's why it's gonna be entry right here on this previous support and exit at that resistance and hopefully if that was correct it's gonna deliver for us almost 170 pips of profit that is not little by the way so we can start buying the pound usd on 1.24565 and keep the trade running just until it hit the nearest resistance with 1.26255 level so hopefully it's gonna work out and hopefully we're gonna make some good profit out of this signal uh, let's check next the AUD USD now the AUD USD has reversed indeed as I predicted in the last weekly analysis video 
it, it reversed from the support level oh sorry from the resistance level now it's the time for the pair to actually uh, finish retesting the broken resistance and in my opinion um, let me just look at the daily candles um, in general the pair is, seems to be falling down these strong bearish candles cannot be ignored most likely the pair is in the end gonna continue falling until hitting this support level however that's not gonna happen right away uh, since we're having here what seems like a fake breakout candle from the resistance on daily candles let's go back to the four hour chart we can expect from the pair to actually fall down let me just be correct um just give me a moment guys i will pause the video to do some more analysis on the aud usd just to be sure yeah just as i thought the aud usd most likely is going to continue the bearish momentum however it's not going to happen right away uh, the aud usd is going to be good for the buy only for very short term I actually you know something i might change my opinion i'm gonna make it for the sell because it's just for very short term i mean on the four hour chart as we can see the pair most likely is gonna reverse on this previous resistance then it's gonna make a pullback then reverse right on this previous resistance and then continue the fall so uh, that's actually not a few pips we are talking about almost 81 pips of profit that's why actually it is really a good level to start buying the AUD USD, but as I said again, only for very short term, only to get the pullback, then from that point AUD USD will fall. Therefore, the signal for the AUD USD is gonna be for the buy on 0 0.64064, and then the next signal is gonna be for the take profit and and for the sell on the level 0 0.64. 834 we have to be very careful careful when we are trading the AUD USD it is getting somehow tricky these days however as I said that previous resistance cannot be ignored and I believe the pair is gonna after the pullback continue falling all the way until it hit this previous support level so if you in your, in your order, in order if you place your sell order right here we can set your take profit level to actually be right on this previous support level right here that's gonna be a lot of uh, profits we're talking about more than 200 pips of profit so please be careful when you are trading this pair and hopefully this signal is gonna work out now let's take a look at the usd cad uh, from the what i see from the usd cad um the usd cad is right now ranging on a previous resistance level on the four hour charts just like that however i think uh, the pair is gonna continue the bullish growth let me just uh, pause the video for a few moments guys i will pause the video and i'll be back to you to show you what my analysis says all right so allow me to say my my expectation for the usd cad for this week actually the pair is ranging on this resistance level for a long time as we can see we had here a simple on the four hour chart a simple uh, resistance number one and if we notice something here the pair has made so many attempts to break out from this level even with this fake breakout it did not work the rejection uh, happened immediately the strength from this level is very strong as we can see it was also a previous key support level and right now it has become a key resistance level so the pair in other words what happened here we can expect for the same thing to happen and therefore we can expect from the USD CAD to just rise a little bit more hitting this previous resistance and then we can start shorting the USD CAD but not for so long time because as we can see the pair is ranging a lot right now so we have to be very careful when we are trading the USD CAD so in other words let me just tell you what is my expectation um, we can start actually shorting the USD CAD right on this level sell the USD CAD on 1.41029 and for the take profit I want to make it really short signal 
therefore I'm gonna select this previous support level right here to be our take profit and we can see that is approximately uh, 73 pips hopefully is gonna be in a profit one uh, take profit is 1.4029 now for the stop loss it's actually gonna be quite easy because if you see any breakout candle happening right out of this resistance level if you see any breakout candle closed or any candle closed as a bullish breakout candle out of this resistance then you have to close the trade with the loss and luckily enough it's not gonna be a lot of pips to be honest it's gonna be like between 25 to 30 pips only we are like unlike the other videos uh, I have seen other analysis videos they are saying the stop loss is 80 pips or 150 pips that is totally unrealistic we cannot set a stop loss so big like that therefore please pay attention guys the stop loss is gonna be short actually uh, I cannot set it to be fixed amount as 40 or 30 right now because we need to see the price action we need to pay attention to it however please take a look at this previous candles here this is a bearish breakout candle from the support level therefore if you see any bullish breakout candle coming out of this resist uh, exceeding this, this re previous resistance you can expect from the pair to actually start reversing right at the same level of this previous week near the bearish breakout candle so you can expect from the pair to go against you for almost 23 pips before it's finally gonna be in profit and hopefully it's gonna reach the desired take profit we are talking about so hopefully this signal is gonna work out as well and we are gonna make some good profit out of this signal now let's check the USDGPY now for the USDGPY the same scenario is happening as well actually as we can see the pair right let me just uh, remove all of that now as we can see the pair is ranging at this previous support level we can see that we had here a very strong key support levels happened on the very same level here then the same level of the support has become a key resistance and from what I can see this resistance is gonna keep its position also as a resistance and the USDGPY is gonna continue falling until it hit that support level right here so USD GPY this week is for the sell let me just select for you the right levels where we can start shorting the USD GPY it's gonna be right here exactly so USD GPY is for the sell on 106.954 and as I said we can keep the trade running until it hit this previous support level we are talking about only yeah sadly only only 40 46 pips no more uh, that is what I can get from the USD GPY sorry guys uh, take profit level is 106.482 so hopefully it's gonna work out and we are gonna make some good profit out of this signal let's check right now the USD CHF the USD CHF also is facing a very similar scenario we can see that the pair is right now on the retesting of this broken uh, strong support level as we can see we had here some fake breakout also from that support level however the pair just continued its bearish momentum and I think it's gonna continue this bearish momentum uh, for this week but not for so long in my opinion also if we want to be fair I believe the USDCHF is gonna continue falling only until it hit this previous support level which was also a key resistance in the past so we can start actually shorting the USDCHF and it's gonna continue falling all the way for also 47 pips um, that is the signal what we can do we can start sell right away for the USDCHF um, you can you might actually expect the trade to go against you for very short te term I mean like here for example let me just be accurate like here yes that is that's more like it let me just uh, delete this guy uh, this uh, line and adjust the sell order and make it on 0 0.96293 yeah sell as 0 0.96293 
so we can expect from this trade approximately 56 pips of profit that is uh, gonna be our take profit level on 0 0.95723 if you notice guys most of these signals are very short term because i want to secure a good profit for those who are joining or following these signals hopefully it's gonna work out especially nowadays the market is not really that stable so we have to not trust it that much last is the gold let's check right now the gold uh, the gold signal last week was actually very good we can see the pair reversed from this previous uh, support let me just go to the one hour chart that was the signal from uh, for the gold to buy on this previous support level we can see it went for like 40 pips against the signal then last or the lately the signal has been in 150 pips of profit it was a good signal delivered to the followers so now let me just check what's gonna happening next with the gold now from what i'm seeing from my point of view actually uh, the gold is gonna be good for the short right away actually we just need to find the right the right level to start sh uh, shorting the gold as we can see we are having here the highest top of that resistance and then that the very same level of the resistance is also another resistance here so meaning this level is being respected this level 1702.28 is being respected not to mention that also right here the pair is right now on it also respecting it meaning the gold is gonna reverse and as usual just to make it uh, safe to the members and the followers i'm gonna make it short term signal to enter to sell order right on this previous resistance and exit the trade at this previous support level so going back to the one hour chart we can expect to start shorting the gold right here exactly sell the gold on 1702.44 and just expect let me just see uh, I just want to make sure it's gonna be a good and profitable signal guys just to make it safe for you I'm gonna make it right on this previous resistance level so we can expect almost 120 pips of profit from selling the gold hopefully it's gonna uh, be accurate and gonna hit our level so uh, I think the next week is gonna be very profitable and good week the market now is easier to read and actually i think it's now more calm from the days when the coronavirus was being spread uh, all over the globe and the news was hitting us every day somehow um we are now getting used to it and i think the market now is more stable than the last uh, two weeks so we can expect a very good uh, week coming ahead hopefully it's gonna be very profitable to everyone so in the end i hope that was informative to you and i would like to thank you for watching